I would like to speak to you about the petition to dislodge Sir Nicholas Sirota after 21 years at the Tate. He's been chillingly successful there. Few dictators have lasted so long or been able to implement their policies so completely. The question is, is he leading us where we want to go? Art is a phenomenon that has lasted as long as Homo sapiens. It is a part of what makes us human. It has the power to unite us across racial and national boundaries. We need art to help us make sense of the world about us. Now we have to put up with some dry nonsense that's been drained of all human interest. The course of art used to be decided by artists and their patrons. But for the last 50 years, it has been decided by art historians. They have suffered from a special sanitized training that has made them quite unfit to appreciate the human aspect of the art of the past, let alone to predict the art of the future. We are presented with the cutting edge, as if this was the forefront of artistic evolution. But evolution works by experiment. All that is new is not necessarily good or useful for our survival. We simply cannot afford to leave unnatural selection in such irresponsible hands. Sir Nicholas has presided over a monoculture more complete than any other European nation. There is no room for dissent. State art rules in Britain. Is that okay by you? Look at the prestigious prizes awarded in Britain or the acquisitions of the Arts Council or Tate Gallery. All necessary stepping stones to a successful career in art. You will see that most works are quite meaningless to us, the public, and the majority of artists. Instead of feeling a part of a shared heritage, we feel excluded. It is a game of chance in which our pension funds are being invested there could be dangerous consequences. I left Britain 25 years ago because I felt there was no room for artists of my type, either in the art schools, the galleries, or in the media. Since then, the situation has got much worse. I ask you to take this rare opportunity to express your longing for a more diverse, more human culture and sign the petition to block Sir Nicholas's reappointment. He's been in charge too long, nor do we want a Sir Rota clone to replace him. We need a massive vote of no confidence in the present regime. Please sign the petition and help artists reclaim their lost initiative in art. We value art because of what it tells us about the values of the society which produced it. What is posterity going to think of ours? <laughs>